Captain John, you have returned. A cursory scan indicates that you are in good health. It fits. Energy spiked a bit, but it's restabilized. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here. You've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. We're going to do great things together. All of us. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm going to be out there for it. And I want you out there as well. You got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. All right. We've got a few more leads we should talk about. First, there's an expedition that Sam Co has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been hard at work tracking down more anomalies. And last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it, no other word. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. Oh, that's right. He wasn't here when you first showed up. He should be back by now. I'll let him handle the introductions. If I steal his thunder, I'll never hear the end of it. His mind is always somewhere, but there's no arguing his knack for being in the right place at the wrong time. Oh, too bad he couldn't see the artifacts coming together. But knowing him, he'll be so excited when he gets a look, it won't occur to him that he's missed anything. We maintain a star station in orbit above us. It's where we do all our deep space scanning. Vladimir runs the station. Brilliant astronomer. Years of practical experience. Feel free to drop some stuff into my bag. Bye. I hope Barrett makes it back to us. Okay, that's it. it. Time to sell some of your junk.
cannot wait to meet him. It's been ages since Constellation has had someone new. I wonder what he's like. Just go easy on him. Being interrogated by a kid ain't exactly the best way to make a first impression. I'll limit it to the really important stuff, Dad. This does not bode well. And you must be the latest poor fool to get dragged into our dysfunctional little family. Just a friendly jab. Small group like this, you'll learn more about everyone than you ever wanted to. Kind of all that family is, in a way. Like more than you'd ever want to know. Hello, kids are around, people. Koriko, by the way. Hi, hi. Nice to meet anyone brave enough to fly the frontier. Know a thing or two about spacecraft, do we? Hey, don't spook our new friend. Frontier's a fine ship. Honest. Now, let's talk business. Sarah tell you about the expedition? You free star. I'm glad to be taking you back to the homestead. I had my fill of it when I was younger, but it always seems to pull us back in, doesn't it? The three of us are heading to Aquila City. You know it, capital of the Free Star Collective. We'll land in the city's spaceports, but the frontier is our goal. It's a rough country, spawned a lot of stories. And I got a lead on a tale that um, makes me think one thing artifact. I know, it's dangerous. That's why I needed backup for this one. But don't let the old children's tales about the Ashta get to you. The real thing is way worse. Yeah, don't piss off the Freestar Rangers. As far as the Collective is concerned, they're judge, jury, and executioner. They're the good guys, but that don't make them any less dangerous. Outside that, just don't be an asshole. Okay. We'll meet you on board your ship. Talk more when we get there. Once we land on Aquila, it's gonna be you and me. So if you want to do any freewheeling before then, Cora and I will just be riding passenger. would be more useful to you aboard your ship than idling here, awaiting tasks.
I've flown across most of the settled systems in all manners of spacecraft, and yet I still get sick on the NAND. There is no such addendum. The war ended almost 20 years ago. I am Representative Evans Chisholm of the Free Star Collective. I've been coming here for months trying to ensure continued peace. I don't make up the laws, Representative. I just enforce them. You have a good day now. Some place else. Is there a problem? What? Can't you see I'm, I'm dealing with something? Sorry, friend. I didn't realize you were one of us. Thanks for your concern. But yeah, it looks like I'm stuck. The girl of this meant to ask me for a diplomatic visa. You know we haven't needed to show one of these since we kicked their asses in the colony war? No, it's not. It's... Mighty kind of you to offer, but look, he knew I was a political envoy before I even landed. But you, you clearly are not going to get the same harassment I did. If you could go to the Free Star Collective Embassy and talk to one of the diplomats, I'm sure they could clear this up. Please, take these credits. I insist. Hello. You will be scanned as you enter the city. Please. Okay, no bounty. You're clear. Enjoy your visit. House Varun abandoned their embassy. Mm, I bet we could have learned a lot from one another. Exactly. It's like, like when someone. Maybe we should stop for a moment at the memorial. You know, hard to believe it's been two decades since we were at war with the collective, when it seems like only yesterday. Only those with an appointment are allowed inside the embassy. Welcome to the Free Star Embassy. Is there something I can help you with? Ah, typical UC security. They try to bully us every chance they get and still manage to play the victim. I get this squared away with the folks down at the spaceport. Thanks for letting us know. 
Don't you worry. I'll have our people go and fetch the representative. The guards will check you at the elevators. Try not to make a fuss.